So, a little update for you guys. Uh, welcome back to Tan Plays MC. We still have not finished the cross yet, but we have been busy. I've been spending a few hours doing this. Finally got it kind of where I want it. So, I'm going to show you. At first, look at these new lamps that we got. They're glorious. And... I put them outside here as well. That right there, that's something special. Remember we had the wheat farm down there. Then I've changed it. So I put these lamps out here. And I think I think they look pretty nice. Um, it's a, just a nice fixture outside. Still trying to get, you know, trying to get rid of torches. I still got to get rid of this and some other ones. But I put these all outside. And I've done some renovation on the inside oops let's get out of this mode so first off this pretty much looks normal although i did have a bed in the middle and i got scaffolding and this is going to be the way that we get upstairs now the other way i had a ladder if you remember going up that way but now it's going to be this way you just hold space and you come right up and did you hear that this is Blue. I named him Blue. He's our pet. If you saw my live stream, we found him in the jungle. Uh, not much has changed here. We still have... Uh, Dragoness, our pet. She wants to kill us. And... Yeah, so, got this right here. And then if we go down... Oh, actually, did I show you what we did with the pool? I added... Well... Alright, I'll show you here. So I added this hole. So now if we swim downward... We can come right out here. And we're down in this hole. Under here. Alright, remember our long staircase down? But... So I've added this area right here. Over here, this is our new and improved storage room. Much better than what we had before. A little more organized. We have some beds down here. We have our super smelter right here. And yeah, a few other items. This is way more organized than what I had before. And I'm these doors are temporary. I think I'll put something else here. I might expand out a little bit. Yeah, we have this here. And if you go up here through the scaffolding, we're in this room again. So this is, I mean, this is the town center. So this is like the central hub, which I, th I think is fitting to have the storage room right below it. Because I had the wheat farm here. Just wasn't doing it for me. So this is... A better use of space and as you can see I have these glorious lamps all around gives off some nice lighting and it's I'm pretty sure it's mob proof so nothing should spawn in here over here we have our new enchanting room which also I think is wonderful very bright uh, we have our barrel right here and we got a bunch of barrels on the side. I At first, I was thinking of using it for all my different, like, materials and resources and stuff. But then I decided, eh, won't worry about that. I'll just use the old-fashioned... Well, I'm, I'm calling them containers, but I know they're chests. So here we have dirt. Put dirt in there. Sand here. Gravel here. Then we have... This is our mis miscellaneous wood. So you have all this kind of junk put in here. Even wood planks. All that. Logs go here. Saplings go here. And leaves go here. Which is very fine. We have a cobblestone. And this is... So I put this block here because this is pretty much for all stone types. As far as, uh, well, stone goes. But you need any stairs, slabs, smooth stone. I mean, snow, stone and stone brick and everything goes in here. This one's for granite. So I got that. 
And then got our wool. Don't have much of wool right now. Uh, that's not very interesting. The food. So this is cooked food. This is food that you can just eat right off the bat. Uh, this is still like food that you wouldn't necessarily like you can use it to make other stuff and it's not cooked that shouldn't be in there and I even just have sort of raw stuff even raw potatoes because they're not cooked cooked potatoes are here uh this is our seeds so we put all of our seeds in here and this is where we're gonna put i'm still trying to figure this out maybe like mob drops and First, we have a super smelter here. I'll go show you the old area because I I tore it some of it down, like I removed the smelter that I had, fixed that water that was falling from the ceiling. Mm, I was trying to redo some stuff. I've raised the ceiling a little bit. I'll still keep this here just for you know old time's sake. But yeah, I removed the super smelter and took away the enchanting room so we don't have that right here something else i discovered which i didn't realize this but pumpkins now grow just like a pumpkin so you see it's just a normal pumpkin now the way that we get a jack-o-lantern I'm going to go grab my one thing over here. I, I I am going to add a tool chest upstairs. I just hadn't done it yet. I was still in the process of moving stuff. But, yeah, if you put this down, you can take shears, jack-o'-lantern, and you get seeds from it, which is very fine. And I'm, I'm curious, can I make just a, a lamp? No, I can't make a lamp that way. I think I I need to have these at least. Yep, and that makes it. So cool. I found out how to do that. I didn't realize that they had changed it to that way. I think I just forgot about it. But yeah, it's a cool little change. And what else? I, I expanded a little bit on our mall over here. As you can see. It was kind of like this right here, except I hadn't even worked on it. So I did this in my live stream and it didn't take me very long. Uh, still in the process of trying to get a panda, but I don't know. I think I, I might put the panda at my palace or maybe I'll create an environment for him down here. I don't know. This was my other idea that I had for uh, my storage, my new storage area, but I'm much happier with what I have now. Uh, it just, it feels better in here. And you know, part of it's like, you just have to start placing blocks and then you see something that you kind of like, and then you start to get happy with what you're seeing. And it's pretty nice as well. Uh, what else did I do? Oh, I got some berry bushes. Check those out. Because, man, it's been a long time since I've... Since I've done a Let's Play video episode. I've been doing a lot of live streams lately. But, yeah, I got my berry bushes. It's cool. I like them. Something I notice: Zombies, they'll avoid... They'll avoid these bushes. Like, if I... If I get behind them... Like, he'll actually try and not step on him. See? So you, you could kind of use him as a, a nice safe bar barrier. Barricade. So that nothing hurts you. So yeah, that's, what's, that's what I've been working on a little bit. And, oh wow, look at that spawn. Uh, our horses, I, for some reason I keep losing my horse that has a saddle on it. Hopefully that's fixed now. We're in a Minecraft 1.14.4, so hope that we don't have the horseshit issue anymore. But 
Yeah, I do have a new horse member right here. That I want to tear down. I was using that for my parrot because my parrot was having a hard time following me and I didn't have a lead, so. I'll probably use these episodes to kind of, I mean, if I do stuff off camera, show you like updates, what's happening. Oh, hey, I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic day and I'll see you in the next episode. So take care and bye-bye.